Hello everyone and welcome to a brand new series that we are trying out on the channel and many of you guys are probably already yelling in the comments below, I can hear it now, Siri it's Dog Hotel, Dog Hotel, yay! And yes, we are finally trying out Dog Hotel, so we have been having so much fun with some of the other trivia games and they're a really awesome company, I really love the games that they've got out there because they're so fun, they're like actually fun, well done animal games. We've been playing Pet World 3D, which is one of those games that I would have been like, I don't know if I'll enjoy this. I look like I'm a little old for that, but actually I had a great time adopting out the animals in Pet World 3D. I had a fantastic time adventuring in the wilderness and sharing some of the wildlife of America and many facts about them with you guys in the wildlife rescue game. And now we are jumping into Dog Hotel, where we get to run our own dog boarding kennel. So I'm pretty excited about that. I hope it means that we'll be able to raise all of these little puppies and have them be really happy and make them really like uh, well behaved and groomed for when their owners come back. I honestly have no idea what this game entails, so we're going to jump into it together and we are going to learn how to take care of the dogs here in the dog boarding kennel together. So let's see what we've got. Welcome to your dog boarding kennel. People bring their dogs to you every day. Your task is to fulfill the needs of the dogs. If you're successful, you'll be able to, sur sur <laughs> to expand your boarding kennel and discover all of the game's possibilities. Have fun playing Dog Hotel. Thank you very much, informational thing. <gasps> Look at the puppy. Oh my gosh, this woman is very frightening. Like her face looks a little scary, but we're going to look at the puppy instead. So we are going to be taking care of Dakota today. And and apparently all of the dogs have a file, like a file too. So Dakota is severely malnourished, improved their diet by feeding them regularly in their enclosure. Well, why am I gonna hand this dog back to you, woman? I'm keeping this dog. If he's severely malnourished, like you don't get him. All right, so Dakota needs lots of food. Here's Dakota. Your boarding kennel consists of five areas. The lobby, which I think is this. The enclosures over here. Wow, look how many. So we've only got two of them outfitted with like food and water right now. And we've got the bathroom to bathe the puppy, I'm guessing. <gasps> Look at this training area. There's agility runs and loops and everything. Okay, so we're at level one. One day has elapsed and we have zero money. We are broke. And oh my gosh, is this like a little play area for the puppies? <gasps> I wonder if we can expand this. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, so that's like where we are. Our first dog just arrived. Is that Dakota? Hi, sweetie. So we're down at the dog enclosure and Dakota needs like food and water, yeah? All right, so this is Dakota. Um, hang on one second. There we go, that's better. Now we can see Dakota's name. So this is Dakota's dog file. We open it up, but look at this poor hungry baby. I don't wanna hand this little Labrador puppy back over to this woman. So severely malnourished, we need to improve their diet by feeding them regularly in their enclosure. But otherwise, looking good, it looks like, I wonder if this is obedience. We've got maybe exercise, health, um, let's see, and like bathing. So Dakota the boy. So Dakota's a little boy dog, okay. We want to tap on the individual characteristics to find out if you regularly give a dog food and water, its diet will improve. Imagine that. So now we know um, what they all are. What's this about? A dog's hygiene will decrease overnight. Bathe or brush them to improve their hygiene again. A dog's affection, oh, so this is affection, increases when you pet or play with them. A dog's fitness increases through training on the obstacle course or in scent training. Ooh, scent training, that sounds so cool. A dog's education can be improved through clicker training or scent trailing. Oh, how fun. Okay, so this is Dakota. We need to get the food and the water put into Dakota's pen. Look at the water splash around, oh my goodness. Hi, baby. Hi, cutie. So we have just completed a mission. Return to the menu and end the day to receive your reward. What if I wanted to do extra things with Dakota? All right, so we already took care of all that. So then we go to the menu. Okay, not that far out of the menu, you guys. Let's see, where's my little missions? There we go. Miss Smith, you need to feed your dog better. I really, I'm worried about that poor little puppy, but Dakota is really well fed, so well done. We have gained experience and we have gained money. Oh, look at our little place. Oh my gosh. What a fun little dog kennel. Here's Bailey. Wow, the guy's scary looking again, but we're okay. Bailey is very dirty, so they must have rolled around in some like mud before getting here. Cooper isn't very athletic. Improve their fitness by training them on the obstacle course. Oh, we've got new things to do. All right, hello puppy. So let's find out about you, Bailey. 
We need to increase, so this is a little girl, a French bulldog named Bailey, and we need to increase her hygiene is the thing. So I'm pretty sure she needs food and water every day too. And then I need to increase her hygiene. So that's this. Oh, there we go. Okay. Hey, yeah. Oh my gosh, look at that in the mouth. Look at that fur flying everywhere. Okay, yeah. Do, 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 do. Behind the ears, down the back, over the tail. There you go, Bailey. All right. Ooh, there we go. Ooh, and we got a little more. Oh, is that more energy for us? What's this? Fascinating. So, Bailey, we still need to finish, like, tidying Bailey up. She's still super messy. Do Can I take her? Bailey, can I take you to the bathroom? <gasps> we can! Okay, so we are in the bathroom with the wee little puppy. And now we can take care of the puppy's hygiene in here somehow. How do I do it? Select the shower head to start cleaning. Is it this? Uh, this? This? Hello? Oh, this! Alright. So you get the puppy all wet. Oh, da -da 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 -da. smells like a little wet puppy. There you go. Oh my gosh, this is kind of fun. Alright, and then we get them all soaped up. There you go, you silly little French bulldog puppy. There you go. I love how it's a collar at the top that you fill the meter with. That's adorable. All right, let's rinse them off. All right. Make sure that you're nice and tight. No, drink the water, you silly pup pup. Don't drink the water. So got that taken care of. And then we need to dry the puppy off. There you go. No wet dog smells in this kennel. So apparently it's a happy puppy. I'm glad Bailey is not a biter while being bathed. That would be pretty bad. There we go, so that's taken care of. All right, Bailey, are you A-okay now? Bailey's A-okay, all right. So now we wanna go back, and let's see, we wanna come over here, and we have Cooper. Cooper isn't very athletic. Improve their fitness by training them on the obstacle course. Okay, Cooper, that's how it's gonna go. I'm gonna make sure you have food and water, though. What's this for? I think everything's pretty clean. Um, what's this? Oh, it's decorations for the room. Wow, look at all the things we can improve. So that's like for the puppies. What is this? It has like a little death sign on it. Oh, for pirates? Oh my goodness, so we could do like a little nautical theme. A little party circus theme, princess theme. Oh my goodness, so we can do lots of cool little decorations. Well, now we've learned about that. But we need to go outside to the obstacle course with this puppy now. So let's take him out there. The obstacle course. Oh, he's a cute puppy. Look at his bill paws. All right, we're gonna improve the dog's fitness out here. Okay, so, oh boy. All right, what are we doing here? All right, I'm gonna help you. Okay, up. Did we do it right? Okay, good. Oh, he did it. All right, and then down. Almost, try again. Darn it, okay, I'll have to try that again. Go, go, go. Good job. Go, go, go. Good job. Come on, you can do it. There we go. All right. All right, there we go. Oh, he's doing good. He's a smart dog, this one. Oh my gosh, we have such a cool little, like, yard to do this in. Oh, I didn't get it. Dang it. All right, let's try this one again. Oh, he did it. Good puppy. And jump. He made it to the end. There you go, little guy. 8 out of 10. Not bad. Not bad for his first run through here. Isn't that so, pup pup? Alright, so this isn't too bad. I think we've got this. Is he not all done? Is he still- Oh, his fitness just needs to increase like the tiniest little bit still. Does that mean we have to take him all the way back out? Oh, I think we do. I think we have to come all the way back out to the obstacle course. It's not too bad though. Alright, let's do this again. Up. Here we go, and jump, and up. No, you were supposed to go up, little one. Why? I like how it changes each time, too. All right, crawl, crawl, crawl. See, I don't know if my dog would ever really be into this. Zoe's, well, Zoe's also a Great Dane, so most people don't have athletic um, exercise areas for dogs built for Great Danes. All right, let's do this down. Oh, good boy. We only missed one of them this time. And down. There we go. Good job, puppy. All right, let's see if his his athletic skill has gone up now. How are you doing, little puppy? Dun, 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 dun. Is he all done? 
And Cooper, how you doing? He's good. All right, you guys. So let's go ahead and close down shop for the day. The owners should come pick up their puppies. Bailey looks r really pretty and well kept. Great job. I'm glad you're happy, Mr. Miller. And Cooper! Wow, Cooper has gotten really fit and strong. Amazing! Well, really, you have to keep it up day by day, sir. It's, it's not just a one-day thing. But there we go, you guys. So we have started to learn the basics of how to take care of the, an the animals, which are the dogs, really, here in the dog hotel. I hope you guys are enjoying. This is much more hands-on with the puppies than what we normally do in Pet Rescue. But let me know if you still miss Pet Rescue, and we'll bounce back there to check in on the animals in Sunflower Rescue Center sometime. But I'm having a great time. I can't wait to share some more animal adventures with you guys in the future, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye!